Looks great. Look at that. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So Fantex has sent us over their vertical GPU bracket. I thought that I would install it in this case because I have such a pretty graphics card. I figured that a vertical GPU bracket would look awesome inside. Make sure to leave me a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, comment below, join the family, all that good stuff, and let's get into it. Here we go. How does this sucker open? There we go. So it will open like that. So there's their Fantex vertical GPU bracket. That's kind of cool. That's what the inside looks like. Let's see here. Oh, this is the PCI Express cable that they include. That's what's in there. Let's see what else. Pull that out. Nothing in there. Here's the bracket. Cool, cool. And then we'll just put that back in there like so. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. Lay the mount down, put the bracket on it, and go from there. Compatibility check the PCI slots. Area must be clear. Modding might be required. <laughs> All right. And then it came with like some foam uh, and some hardware. So, all right, cool. Sheets of foam. Now, my question is, how am I going to get this thing in here? Now, unfortunately, we have to shut all the pretty lights off. Bye bye pretty lights. I guess essentially it will sit like, I guess it'll sit like that inside. Okay, so I got a lot to do. So what I need to do is get a Phillips and start removing the GPU bracket or the GPU holder bracket. cables to the power like that oh nice and easy whoops I forgot about the IO that's a very easy mistake to make all right now if I remember correctly this was a lot of fun to do because of the water pump there we go got it up okay oh. all right so i guess i'm gonna have to do some modifying just like the thing said we're gonna have to cut this off so i can get this to fit uh, i'm assuming most of the times that it would just go behind the motherboard like this but it doesn't it doesn't act like that See, I, I feel like I'm going to do damage to it. Yeah, see, I feel like I'm going to damage the board doing that. Uh, so, yeah. Let's cut this off. Be back. Okay, so I cut it off. Um, I slightly bent it, but you can't tell. So, and then I hit it with a little spray paint just to try to hide some of the blemishes but now I believe that this will mount like that see it'll mount up to these holes like so. okay now the back side see the back sides kind of bowed out and that's what that back part was for was to grab it but I just cut that back part off so I think what I'll do is I'll use a zip tie and just hold it flush and then that little space underneath there we'll slide one of these underneath it and we should be good all 
right, and then the next step is to install this thing, which I'm just going to lift it up and set it down. That. All right, so I believe our bracket is actually installed now. All right, so. Okay, I can see now that what I, shit. The GPU IO goes through. Well, it's not gonna fit with this in the way. I just realized that. So now I'm gonna have to cut that off, which if I cut that off, then that means that you will not be able to go back to an original setup. You will have to stay vertical with this setup. Hmm. I didn't think about that. So I have, I cut it off there, except for the top and the bottom, like I said, to keep this, cause I have to keep this rigid support here. Um, and then I tried to, I covered it up and hit it with black paint um, to try to hide some of the, the cut marks and stuff. Uh, let's see here if I can get this thing installed. It's hitting this valve right here. You can see where it's touching it. I can put, I can put a little bit of strain on this pipe, but not too much. Um, because originally when I designed this water loop, I designed it for the way that the graphics card sat. But now since I got this whole situation happening, let's see here if I, if I can just kind of grab it and push on it. Will it, will it take place then? There it goes. Like that. And maybe I can move the valve. Like this. Oh, moment of truth. Let's see what it looks like. So there you have it guys. I hope y'all liked it. Make sure to leave me a like if you liked it. This was the Fantex vertical GPU bracket and riser cable kit. I will leave a link in the description below. Only if you guys will leave me a like and a comment. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe. We could always use noob subscribers. We're trying to get to the 1000 mark. I figure that if YouTube wants me to get to 1000 subscribers, then it will happen. But I need y'all's help to get me there. Thank you for watching. As always, you guys be cool, and I appreciate y'all. See y'all in the next one.